yard hot. So this is the uh, first floor and second floor, ground floor. Sorry, first floor. Um, so as you can see, got a garage. Doorway, doorway here. So I've got a bit of a dog leg down down this flank. Uh, no, no problem. We'll get around that. So we've got all these internal walls as well. With um, 906 open. We've got the living room, chimney, going into a little study. So, this bit here that's a single story, this is going up. Um, there is here a gold post RSJ system going in. Um, so that make the kitchen dining the sort of family oil is one area. And then um, upstairs you've got the garage, you've got a, a master bedroom above the garage. So that wall there that you see just here that will continue up, so that's what that S wall is. Um, there's no internal block work above that one, that's it. Other than that bit, so that's how long the, that bit is. So, I think I probably bored you enough. Well, that's right. Um, elevations, well, I do apologise that not a big copy. Um, it'll just have to make do for the time being. Gives you sort of a rough idea. So that's as you look in from the street. So that's the front door. That's looking at the garage doors. And then you've got the back. So we've got like bifold doors and um, it's the other flank, that's with the dog legs in. So yeah, we're at, uh, we're at the point, oh, where are we the door? This is where we're at, we've got the blues down, unfortunately I didn't have enough space on my hard drive on that last week as um, I explained on my last video but um, Getting it sorted now. There's the Blake is set up. Pretty straightforward to set up, guys. 
what I did was, was originally this ground was up to this sort of block height. But what I did is, is to set the blues up before I might as well set the blakies up. So I dug this out and then set my blakes. I've gone around on every corner pretty much. I've got this same thing with this profile at the bottom. Got an internal. All pegged up. So what I've got is guys, is I've got Oh, so I've got insulation going down here and I've got a radon barrier going from this block course going down onto here. So I was going to get the on today so I could stick it to the blues, but with a wet day, it's just it's not going to happen. So yeah, we use the sack truck to load out. Anything to save a bit of legwork. <coughs> Another thing is these air vents. There's going to be a tray here, so I'll have a wee pole, a wee pole, pretty straightforward. Same thing with the blade just here. Thought I'd set it up, so I just, you know, dug it away. So I don't have to set that up again until, well, until I want the jaws lift. Same thing with the internal. It's pretty easy to set this up, to be fair, once you've got the blake up and just butt it up and obviously just F clamp this side and then you just oops sorry get your plumb rule and then yeah tighten her up now the old block dollies out I do like a good old block dolly so they are good bits of kit this is where the bold bifold doors are. Just there. Um, yeah. It's all good. In the hood. Little panel there. Same thing with the bikes. Managed to finish all the block and beam floor today. Got got some cuts in, um, and then at the end of the job, we'll just make like a bit of a paste with just some cement and just sort of smear it all over, so it all like, keeps it all locked in and stuff. Obviously I ain't got a, enough blakers, so I have to do it the old, old school way. So, just prop one side going that way, and the other, jobs are good in. Good old F clamps. I have raked the old out. I haven't brick acid the blues yet. Um, I'll wait until I've built brickwork up first, and then go again. This is the front. and went mad, he goes, where's all my wood gone? <laughs> I was like, there, please, my props, lad. And it was all good. But all the timber for all the profiles and stuff will all be used 
all the stud work inside, so it won't go to any wastage. And uh, I dry bonded it all the way along here, so obviously so I could get it so it worked brick above the lintels. Um, yeah. Like down here. And over here is where when we have deliveries to come in here. It's reversing. And a pack put packs of blocks, bricks, whatever we need just here. Cement. Water bots. Water tubs. Yeah, that's what I noticed earlier. Really. One of the oddies, look up. They don't care did they look? I only had this, what? Last week, you know, it's pretty much knackered. So, yeah, I'm docking him out of his wages for that. <laughs> um, for the time being, we ain't got to skip. So, um, we're sort of, when well, we fill a full bag up, and then we're going to the, um, the down the tip, so, um, I'm not sure with them to be honest with you. So, but clients dealing with that. So, so this is where we have the little mixer just here, and then over here is sort of any bits, you know, bits and bobs that are needed to store, sort of get out of the way. This is such up. decent blues, best blues. So, it's pretty much the job, guys. Um, really? This mountain building supplies. So, get your materials for them. They'll give you good, good rates, I'm sure. So, uh, yeah, I think I think that's what I've covered everything. Good front door. Got to grout that bit still through the ground. And then there's a door here, straight through, and then straight through, yeah, into the garage. So, yeah, that's everything, guys. I'm not going to put leave, you know, bore you to death anyway. Um, so, yeah, I'm back in the nice and warm now. As soon as I sink, and that. There's the uh, shit house blues. It's where all the fun happens. <laughs> so yeah, it's all good. We'll get looked after. And um, yeah, until next time, guys.